What's up guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Mo. So happy to be here with you guys as always. And guys, <laughs> hey, welcome back, Mo. As always, we are here. Well, I guess not as always. I don't know what I just said. <laughs> we are here with another episode of Max That, guys. We are getting real close. If we go over here and click on our um, base, we can see that we have 30 of the level 8 walls, guys. So we are slowly, slowly moving up with those. Um, I am all done with all my elixir upgrades. As you can see, my second dark barrack is upgrading so that I can have golems in both of them to level 4. Um, all of our mines, all of our gold mines are level 11, so we can't upgrade any more of those with elixir. Um, only stuff we have left to upgrade are the elixir collectors, which uses gold, so um, I'm not going to... That's, that's definitely not my priority. Um, and then all of our defenses are upgraded besides the Teslas, which you can see these two right here going up to level 5. Um, this one is at level 4, so that one has two more levels, and then these two each have one more level. So we have four more upgrades for the Teslas before, excuse me, before we are all maxed out with our defenses. Our um, drill right here is all done. We cannot upgrade that anymore. All of our barracks are at level 10, so we are done with that. Um, so I guess pretty soon um, I am going to be able to start using um, pretty crazy armor comp, not pretty crazy army compositions, but ones that use up a lot of elixir. Because as you can see, my P.E.K.K.A. Um, still has <laughs> eight and a half days on it, which sucks. Um, I can't upgrade my spells. I just have to wait for that. So, um, yep. Yeah. And I don't think I'm going to be upgrading all of my dark troops because that is a lot of dark elixir. And I'm trying to upgrade my king. As you can see, I'm at 23,000 dark elixir. So, um, wait, can I actually upgrade? I can't upgrade him right now. Shoot. Upgrade. That's right. There he goes. So, <laughs> awesome. So, he is upgrading to level 6 right now. Um, I am going to start... Saving some of my gold to um, upgrade this Tesla Tesla next. You guys always, or a bunch of people always comment about how I say the word Tesla. I don't think it really matters. It's Tesla. S can sound like a Z sometimes too. <laughs> um, so there is that. This is going to be done in three hours. Uh, so that will be up to level 10. And that will give me another builder for my walls. But hey, why don't we go ahead and go on the attack, guys. And uh, we'll see what kind of base we can find. Um... I've been using this army composition for a while now, and I really, really like it. That base is too upgraded. <laughs> um, all I'm using is tier 1 troops. I've seen some comments that say Molt doesn't know how to raid. Um, but I'm using this army composition because it's cheap, and um, it can be effective. You just have to search a little bit longer to find the right kind of base. And I know that y'all are watching me search, and I haven't done this in a while, but I'm just talking at you guys, and hopefully we can find something. Um, but... The army composition that I'm using is I use five wall breakers, five giants. Here we go. This base looks awesome. Um, I'm going to talk for about 20 seconds. So five giants, five uh, wall breakers, um, just to kind of help get them in there. And then just a bunch of other tier one troops like uh, archers and things of that sort. I'm going to go ahead. All right. So he does have some troops in the clan castle. Um, so I'm going to see if we can get rid of them. Wow, he actually has a lot of troops in the clan castle. Um, so we're going to try and clear all them out. And then I guess since we've already deployed a lot of troops on this side, we'll go ahead and attack from this side as our main um, as our main attack point. So there we go. I'm going to drop down those giants and then get in um, our wall breakers in here. We are going to drop a heal spell right here. Um, just so that the Giants and the rest of the troops can get healed up a little bit. Um, healing spells are uh, cheaper than Rage spells, which is why I use them. And because I'm not running with a healer, I have to do that. Um, we are going to drop another heal spell right about here. There we go. Get those archers in there. And then let's see if we can start pumping in um, some of our goblins into the center as well. Um, I can drop off a couple more archers out here. Um... And you can see that our troops are working their way in. Go ahead. I'm going to drop a heal spell right here as well. Okay, I got it just in time to keep all of those goblins up. Drop the rest of those guys in. And then as you can see, our giants are slowly working their way around the outside. Um, and 
I'm going to go ahead and drop down our uh, clan castle right here as well to start help cleaning up some of this, uh, some of these extra buildings on the outside. Um, like those pumps and, and whatnot. We have an okay amount of troops still in the middle. Um, that mortar is doing a lot of damage. Uh, I wish that his clan castle, one of the things that made this a little bit harder than usual was the number of troops that he had in his clan castle because um, I had to deploy. It looked like he had a lot of my max level archers and whatnot. Um, but thankfully, actually that mortar is about to shoot over here. He should only get, there he goes. So he one-shotted that one archer. No, why don't they move down to that gold storage? All right, so it looks like, but they are out of range of the mortar right now. So once they move in, they will get one shotted. But hopefully, they can um, get a pretty good amount of that loot first. Boom. So we only have a couple left. Um, there go the rest of them. One more left. He's doing okay, getting about a thousand gold per tick, and we are done. So as you can see, guys, ninety-three thousand gold, not too bad. One hundred sixty thousand elixir and two hundred and sixty. Um, Dark Elixir. I'm going to return. That wasn't one of the best of the raids because the clan castle kind of um, threw some trouble into that. But let's go back in my attack log like I've been doing lately to kind of show you guys how it's been going. So there's the most recent one. This next one, 216,000 gold. Guys, that's with the same exact army composition. Um, this next one, 195,000. 196. This next one, 92,300,000 thousand elixir, which was beastly. 240,000, 207, 150, 191, 229, 100, 212, 281. As you can see, guys, all the way down, it's a very, very cheap army composition, and I get pretty good loot out of it. So, um, with me not having to use like wizards or anything like that, I'm saving my elixir. Um, which makes it cheaper and it makes it more efficient because every 20 minutes I can raid. When you use wizards and dragons and things like that, you can't raid but every 45 minutes. Um, so I get double the raids for cheaper and more loot from that. So that's my reasoning behind all of that. Um, I'll go ahead and show you what I do. I count out to 5 and then I train up to 21 minutes. I count out to 5 and then I train up to 21 minutes again. I kind of figured out the timing on it. And then I just split up the archers and the barbarians until we hit around 21 minutes. Um, and then in this last one, I just go until I hit 200, but it's going to be about 21 minutes, just like in the other one. So there we go, guys. That is it. I um, hope that you all enjoyed this Max Out episode, guys. We are getting very close. Um, we got to level up the Barbarian King in this one. Um, and just before this, I upgraded another wall. Hopefully, we can get this center compartment done um, pretty soon in a couple days, maybe. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. As always, thank you so much for watching. I hope that y'all enjoyed. I hope that y'all are looking forward to Town Hall 9 as much as I am. We should be there by the end of the month, so get ready, guys. That's going to mean more base builds. That's going to mean. Just a whole lot more um, stuff. So thank you so much, as always, for watching, guys. This has been another episode of Max That. You guys rock. And as always, guys, make sure that you keep calm and clash on for me, all right? I'll see you guys later.